hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel myself shridevi and i am from sri venkateshwara college of engineering bangalore and i am from computer science and artificial intelligence branch and section infinity today we will discuss about a topic of um, introduction to factorial and binomial factorial in the python programming these two topics plays a significant role in various mathematical computations and real world applications we will know how to write in this topic we will know how to write a function to calculate factorial of a number and to develop a program to compute binomial coefficient in this video we will explore these topics in depth and also understand the understand the various significance and also learn how to implement and optimize the optimize their calculations by using python introduction to factorial and binomial coefficient factorials are a fundamental concepts in mathematics representing the product of all positive integers up to a given number binomial coefficients are used in combinatorics to determine the numbers of ways to number of ways to choose a subset of items from a large set understanding these concepts is well essential for solving various mathematical problems and algorithms now we will see what is a factorial the factorial of a non negative integer n is denoted as n factorial and it is also defined as n factorial is equals to n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into so on by convention the factorial of 0 is defined as 1 which helps maintain consistency in mathematical formula factorial grows with very quickly as n increases making them valuable in permutation and combination now we see how to calculate factorial using python to calculate a factorial in python you can use uh, either an iterative or re recursive approach the re iterative method involves using a loop to multiply numbers in decreasing order until it reaches 1 here, here is a sample function to compute factorial iteratively from python from python define factorial of n which is uh, which results 1 for i in range of 1 comma n plus 1 which results a uh, 120 recursive approach to factorial a recursive approach involves the function calling itself within a with a reduced value until it reaches the base base case the base case for factorial is when n is equals to 0 or 1 where the function returns 1 below is a sample recursive function to calculate factorial in python define factorial of n if n is equals to 0 or n is equals to 1 returns 1 else return n introduce to introduction to binomial coefficient the binomial coefficient denoted as c of n comma k represents the number of ways to choose k elements from a set of n elements it is calculated using the formula like c of n comma k is equals to n factorial divided by k factorial of n minus k or factorial here is the example for binomial coefficient next computing binomial coefficient using factorial to compute the binomial coefficient we can 
leverage the factorial function we defined earlier this involves uh, calculating the factorial of n comma n comma k comma and uh, n minus k and applying them in the binomial coefficient formula here is this python function to compute the binomial coefficient in python define by bi binomial coefficient of n comma k which results a factorial of n divided by factorial of k next example for um, binomial coefficient calculation suppose we want to calculate c of 5 comma 2 which represents uh, choosing two items from a set of five using our binomial coefficient function we could um, compute c of 5 comma 2 is equals to 5 factorial divided by 2 factorial into 3 factorial which gives 10 applications of binomials and uh, binomial coefficients and factorials binomial coefficients and factorials have applications in probability theory statistics and combinatorial Opti optimization they are used in calculating permutations combinations and also probabilities in various sensories additionally they are essential in algorithms for generating combinations and permutations in programming performance uh, consideration Factorial calculation can become computationally expensive for large number due to their rapid growth. Using min mem memorization or iterative method can help optimize factorial computations. The binomial coefficient can also be computed directly using iterative approaches to avoid large intermediate values last and final one conclusion understanding how to calculate factorial and binomial coefficient is virtual in uh, various fields including computer science and mathematics the functions we developed provides a solid foundation for further exploitation of combinatory algorithms Mastery of these concepts will enhance your problem solving skills and uh, mathematical iteration. Thank you. Thank you for watching. If you found this useful, please like, share and subscribe.